Morning, everyone. Today's gonna be an interesting day. We had rain yesterday, so we weren't able to work, and today we have to make up for yesterday, and it's supposed to rain the rest of the week after today. So uh, we're gonna do the large yards that have to be done today, and we'll fit the rest of them in as we can. So uh, let's get the trailer loaded up, and let's get started. Good morning everybody, welcome to another day at Mark's Misfit World. I hope you enjoy what we're doing today because it's a little bit nippy for us, but you know there's lots of lines to mow today so that's a good thing so I guess we just carry on to our yards. It's already did the morning stuff. Well I, <clears throat> I wasn't in the morning stuff so I'm here now in the mid morning stuff. We just got started mowing the lawns. We did our first lawn already. Like I said before, we have a misfit channel. You never know what's going to happen through the video. Or, we just got done with our first yard. It's 48 degrees, 30 mile an hour winds, roughly. Um, my fingers are cold. Vicky's still bundled up and she's in the truck. Yeah, my ears get a little bit nippy. Yeah, so it's, uh, we're still getting used to the cold weather. We got a ways to go yet um, before we get used to it. I don't know if we ever get used to it, but we kind of tolerate it, I guess. So it's 48 and the feel like temperature with the wind is 40 degrees. So there you go. It's almost cold enough to snow. It was just a little bit colder. Yeah. Well, you're not too far off. It wouldn't would surprise me though if we seen some snowflakes today. Yeah, I don't think we're going to see them, but it sure is going to feel like it. And I just made a wrong turn. I should have gone left instead of right. Oh well. Where are we going? So, uh, somewhere along the line, we get out of this wind. I'll, I'll set the camera up because uh, right now I know it will not stand up. And, uh, we're going through these yards, we're getting the smaller ones first, and hopefully the, it warms up a little bit this afternoon so we get them bigger ones, because once we get on them big yards, it's going to get cold real fast on us. And, I think and it's going to wear us out fast. <clears throat> and I think I'll be putting on more clothes here shortly, because uh, probably right after lunch I'll be putting on my, uh, my coveralls or my bib, <laughs> insulated bibs. Can't say I'm... I can't believe I was saying I'm putting the insulated bibs on already. Boy, this summer flew by us. So uh, I guess we're gonna go off to the next yards. Okay, uh, I'm gonna set you up in this yard. I'm gonna get here. I'm gonna zoom in on this. Squirrel with the chestnuts. So uh, I'll get you set up low here and uh, we're gonna start on this yard.
Okay, yard's all done. Vicky's just blowing everything off. Just blew out the gutter there, so if it does rain a lot, it doesn't uh, back up into the yard. She also got some leaves up in here, but we'll be back here next week to chop up more leaves. And this chestnut tree is just starting to drop all the chestnuts. So that's going to be a mess here next week. Okay, just did a couple more yards. Uh, we're double cutting everything. We're cutting it kind of short. And uh, trying to get some of the leaves to blow off. Blow off? Or not stick, I guess. And uh, so it's a little bit of work now, a little bit of crushing up the leaves or mulching them all up, but we will have to do uh, less cleanup. The leaves are all down because uh, a lot of them will just blow off down the road, off into the woods someplace or someone else's yard. But um, uh, we're going to go home and eat lunch now. Warm up a little bit. And uh, sun's out, so it's making us feel a little warmer anyhow. There's been some comments more than once about um, I should be in a different business than I am because I am not super happy and bubbly person all the time. Um, I'm not a super happy bubbly person. That's just uh, not not me. Yeah, I like to have fun. Yeah, I laugh a lot, but uh, not all the time. He just takes lawn care serious, and when it doesn't go the right way, then he's not happy. It's not that I'm not happy, I'm frustrated, I guess. He gets frustrated because we have too many things that go wrong. That's why we're called the Mark's Misfit World. Yes. So, and that's how that is. And some of you have may figure it out, some of you have not, but I had, do have ADHD, and it is very hard to control emotions. And I am taking medications to help bring that down, which also brings everything else down. So. And the weight loss, he doesn't drink his Mountain Dew, so he doesn't have the caffeine like he did. And it's just, you know, you hear what he has to say, and sometimes I have to deal with his upsets. Upsets? And, upsets, that's my It makes me. You know, a lot of people say, oh, she looks crabby. Well, I'm not actually crabby. I just, I'm just serious, I guess, when I'm mowing the lawns. Oh, man, I, I just, you know, that I stay focused. And so it may look like I'm crabby, but I'm really not. Some days I could be crabby, but for the most part, not usually. And for the most part, we're not crabby people. But um, with the ADHD... There is uh, extreme emotions. It's don't take a whole lot to uh, change my mood or set me off, I guess. That's just the way it is. And people out there with ADHD understand what I'm talking about. Uh, people don't have it, don't understand what we go through, which is uh, extreme mood swings all the time. As you could be super happy, five minutes later, you're just mad at the world. That's just the way it works. And and then, you know, lately we haven't had much sun, so that doesn't help. You know, we're only in September and October, and, you know, we haven't had many days of sun, and that's kind of early for not, us not to have that. Usually that doesn't happen until, like, December. And then you get the doom and the gloom going on, and it's like... You need to have the sunshine to lift your spirits a little bit. Yes. And it, we've been struggling with the weather, extreme weather patterns for the past year. And that doesn't help out a lot, or help out too much with the frustrations. Because we get frustrated uh, quite a bit. And we're not the only lawn care companies, company around in our area that gets frustrated with the weather. Because it's, it's a tough battle. It's a very tough battle. We're gonna go home and eat lunch now, which I think I said already, and then we'll get back with you after lunch. Okay, we just got uh, done with uh, one of our three big yards that have to be done today. And that one was a little bit sheltered. It was still kind of cold, but not as bad as it was earlier. The wind's calmed down a little bit, and the sun's out, so it feels a little warmer. <clears throat> still cold, but it feels warmer. My fingers aren't as frozen as they were. 
And we're going to go out to, uh, to one surrounded by water and just happen to remember we had to cut one just before that. So we almost forgot that one. That one's a kind of like an on-call customer, which I think you've seen that one a couple weeks ago. But we're going to go grab that one first before we go grab the one out on the water. And the one out on the water I think is going to be pretty cold because uh, we're not going to have be sheltered by anything. So it's going to be just like open area for the wind blow across us. So uh, we'll see after that yard. <coughs> well, that was fun. Vicky went and blew all the leaves out from around the house. Got them all put in one area. Before I could get there, the wind blew it all over a different direction. Uh, welcome to fall. So it wasn't too awful bad. It was, uh, this house is... <laughs> It's got two different temperatures at this house all the time. It was cold on one side, not too bad on the other side. But man, we got it all done and the guy really needs to turn the sprinklers off because the water, Vicky said the water was just flying off my tires. And we got all that rain. We got probably about two inches of rain yesterday and his sprinklers are still on. So he just, he's not ready to give up his green grass yet, which I don't blame him, but. But it's not gonna be green because it's fall. Yes, so he's got a, He's fighting every bit of it, so <laughs> that's just the way it works. Okay, so we're gonna go to uh, our last big yard, and, uh, and then we got one small yard after that, and that'll be it for the day. Okay, just finished up our last big yard. We have uh, one more small yard that we have left to do, and we're not gonna do that one until after five. That's the house with the daycare at it there. We gotta wait till all the little children are picked up, and then we can go mow it. So it's a, uh, my knee's got a little cold on that one. We were on that one oh, a good 45 minutes on that yard. So we're gonna stop at home, check on the dogs, and uh, get something to drink, and then we're head off to the last one. Okay, we just finished our last yard there. Um, in the daycare, we moved all. Uh, outdoor playthings up against the fence because we're not coming back to this area because that one's done for the season and it's so cold out I don't think the kids are gonna be out there playing anyhow so um, that one's done for the season and we are done for the day it got all the way up to 50 degrees today yeah that's cold I think it got to like 53 but okay well I but it was still, the feel like wasn't even 50. Probably. Well, it could have been 53 because it was warm for two yards today. And uh, tomorrow, I don't know what the weather's supposed to be tomorrow. It's supposed to be 20% rain, but I don't think it's going to rain. Well, we're hoping it doesn't rain. We're banking on it doesn't rain. Because that way uh, we can get everything done tomorrow. We got 10 to do tomorrow. 10 lawns to do? That's not bad. Not at all. small. We got a couple white. One really big one, but the rest are small. Yeah, I like small yards because we can get them done quickly and uh, have a fairly easy day tomorrow. So that is going to be the end of our video for today. I thank you for watching and subscribing. If you could check out the links in the description box below, we'd greatly appreciate it. Have a good evening. See you at the next yard. Peace be with you. Bye-bye.